All right, lots of excitement over here in the Ochoa division. Please direct your attention over here to field one as we meet our teams for qualification match number 143. First, let's meet our Red Alliance, starting with Team 7236. Recharged Green from Pella, Iowa. And joining them on the Red Alliance, it's Team 11697. Robotics from East Brunswick, New Jersey. And representing the Blue Alliance, first up it's Team 7023. Hexasonics from Allendale, Michigan. And rounding out our teams for blue, it's 12-8-3-3. Mechanical Meltdown from Watkins Glen, New York. All right, I got a thumbs up from our head referee. Robots are primed and ready for their mission. So, Red Alliance, are you ready? Blue Alliance, are you ready? Robots ready, autonomous mode in three, two, one, go. All right, we enter the autonomous period with 30 seconds on the board. All four robots descending from the lander structure. On the Blue Alliance, one, two, eight, three, three, correctly samples for the Blue Alliance and their partner. Looks like they did the same, but also knocked a silver mineral, unfortunately. On the Red Alliance, looks like we had one team sample as well, or both teams sample with one team parked with eight seconds remaining. Looks like our robots are going to park in the craters. Looks like three of our four are parked as we round out the autonomous period. Make that all four parked, Driver, it looks like. Pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. All right, really great match with Autonomous. Let's see if that continues over to Teleop. I think it will. Looks like we have two of our, three of our robots collecting minerals and depositing them. On the Red Alliance, we have team one, one, or seven, two, three, six, recharged green, getting two loads already for the Red Alliance. Meanwhile, Mechanical Meltdown is collecting from that same crater on behalf of the Blue Alliance. Back on the Red Alliance, Robotics gets a load. Hexasonics collects a load with a minute 30 remaining in the match. All four teams collecting minerals, depositing them in the lander. One, two, eight, three, three scores for the Blue Alliance. Their alliance partner is right next to them collecting. Meanwhile, Recharged Green gets another load, and their alliance partner, Robotics, gets another load. We have a minute 15 remaining in the match as all four robots continue to collect minerals from the craters and lift them up to the lander structure. Looks like we have three teams in one crater. Mechanical Meltdown continues to collect on their crater with a minute remaining in the match. Recharge Green gets another load. We have 56 seconds on the clock. Teams are still continuing to collect minerals. All four robots are still online and driving around. Looks like we have three of our robots de depositing at the same time with 15 seconds till end game. Let's see how many more minerals are scored. Looks like this is shaping up to be a great match in terms of minerals. All right, we have eight seconds till end game as all four robots continue to score minerals in the lander structure and collecting from the craters. Mechanical Meltdown has the load lifted up. Recharge Green gets the load lifted up and scored as we enter the end game period here on Ochoa Field number one. No robots are latched in quite yet. They're still scoring minerals with 20 seconds on the clock still. But it looks like Recharge Green is trying to get off the ground for the Red Alliance with 14 seconds to go. They're latched in, it looks like, with 10 seconds on the clock. Robotics gets another load scored up as we have three, two robots off the ground right now with three seconds on the clock. Can we get all four off the ground? We will see, and that will be the end of qualification.